Hello and welcome back to my channel. I am Taja, your self love soul sister. Today we celebrate a milestone. I am one year and nine months locked in. It has been um, a journey for sure. I can't wait to dive into all of the ups, the downs, the growth that's been intertwined into this journey. So I want you to take a look at this journey. On one side, the first day, a canvas of potential. On the other side, right now, a tapestry of growth. Okay. As you can see, my hair has just grown so much. It has flourished and I am really, really happy about this. I really am. Now let's talk about the real stuff. The journey, of course, wasn't always easy. There were moments when I doubted myself. There were moments when my hair was just not the way I wanted it to be. I was bored with it, of course. I've had days when the mirror felt like a judge. Patience became a daily lesson. I remember the first stage when I just had these little twists in my hair. First of all, pause. I didn't know that when you first get your hair twisted while it's wet, <laughs> the shrinkage is real. I started with two strand twists. I think it's easier because you can style it better, if that makes sense. It's just like having like a braid out or a set of knotless braids, except it's twisted. Mine came about, it was about bob length, I'll show you. I did have a good experience in the beginning. I was telling my sisters, I know, like, I'm definitely not gonna lock my hair. That's just something that I wouldn't do. And damn it, here I am. <laughs> what has this lock journey taught me? Ooh, girl, y'all ready? Y'all got some pen and paper? First of all, this vlog journey has taught me a lot about patience, okay? Knowing that this is a process, this is a journey, kind of forced me to be patient. Another thing was just self-love. Being in this world of social media, I always ask myself this one question. What makes you different? What separates you? I learned what made me stand out instead of blending in. It taught me to love myself, be patient with myself, be kind to myself. This was a process and it was it was different because it was something that I wasn't used to. Definitely took me out my phone. Another thing that I would say I learned is to have fun. This long journey has definitely brought out a side of me that I wish I would have unleashed before, but also realizing that it had to take time to figure out who I am. And I love that for me. And I would love that for you when you figure that out as well. I just wanted to have fun and play with my hair and experiment and sit with myself and think, would I have learned this if I didn't go on a long journey? It's just different when you have to start over from scratch. It brought out a different me and I just knew my locks were a reflection of my own growth and it showed. Just like life, this journey really had its twists and turns. So I challenge you right here, right now, to look into the mirror. Look at yourself with love, admiration, and pride. You're a masterpiece in progress. And just like my locks have grown, you too have grown in ways you probably don't even realize. As I, or we, celebrate one year and nine months, I want you to celebrate your journey as well. Embrace every lesson, every challenge, and every moment that's brought you here. You're on a journey of self-love, self-growth, and self-empowerment, just like me. So thank you, my beautiful, beautiful souls, for being a part of this journey with me. Your support, your love, it really means the world to me. As we move forward, let's continue to nurture our locks and nurture our souls. Stay beautiful, stay empowered, and always remember that you are loved just as you are. Until next time, stay true to you.